Hi and welcome to a quick tutorial about why I use color coding and why you should use color coding. Look at this here. We've got 47 tracks and then we've got our buses here, right? This is my tutorial I did for the series, how to make a track. Now look at that, all in the same color. Just look at this, it's just like mind-bogglingly confusing. So it's just like uh, the, the kicks there, you've got to look for it. Now where's where's, uh, where's the other oh, claps are there? You're gonna, what, so, so yeah, you can't find your way around it. So now let's look at the difference when it's actually color coded. So here's the same session, but with colors. So you can see my kicks are here under this color. My drums are brown, my bass is blue, my keyboards are green, my voices are pink, and my effects are sky blue. You can choose what colors you want, but that's what I use. Anyway, you can see straight away where everything is. I mean, you don't have to look for stuff. You don't have to think about it. So your workflow is going to be faster. Oh, where's the bass? There, blue. Where's the drums? Oh, yeah. You just got to look down, find a hi-hat, the, the, the kicks, yeah, uh, vocals. Anyway, basic stuff. So there you have color coding. I hope this will help you in your producing so like subscribe leave a comment hit the bell for notifications and i will see you soon